Scientists now think we may be able to improve babies' language just by the way we talk to them. I can see you. Good communication skills accelerate children's ability to think and learn for themselves. Hello. Hi. Here at Cambridge University, Professor Usha Goswami has set up an experiment to find out the best way to talk to a baby. I'm going to start the experiment. I can see you. I can see you. I can see you. It can only happen in the controlled conditions of this tiny room. I can see you. It's insulated to prevent electrical activity interfering with these highly sensitive baby brain scanners. The team are using this setup to find out what's happening inside babies' brains when they listen to parentees. I can see you. That special way of speaking that we all automatically seem to use whenever we talk to babies. I can see you. I can Parentese see is a way of speaking that heightens pitch, exaggerates the length of words, and is very rhythmic. Jump and jump. Now Elsie's taking part in the experiment. Like you show me your toy. She listens carefully to the parentese. But when it comes to the normal speech, she quickly loses interest. <laughs> this pattern of behaviour is backed up by other studies that show babies prefer to listen to parentese. I can see you. I can see you. But what's happening inside their brains? Bunny rabbits jump and jump. But you can see the brain waves changing in real time. When Usha analyzes the data, she discovers something extraordinary. Baby's brain, the electrical signaling, is pulsing basically in time with those big rhythm patterns. I can see. This brain synchronization is represented in this simulation. Bunny rabbits jump and jump. Usha and her team are the first in the world to show that parentese contains these large rhythmic modulations and that this matters for babies' developing brains. So this is incredible. It is, it is. In effect, those big peaks in the signal of the infant-directed speech are being picked up by the brain in a very nice, synchronous fashion. Hello. Babies' brains react like this because parentese exaggerates the rhythm of words. When you speak to a baby using parentese, you're providing optimal input for the brain. You're basically enhancing the kind of acoustic landmarks that the brain needs to lock onto to be able to proceed with the rest of speech processing, which is the most complex thing the brain does, actually. Hi, Sophie. It seems natural that we would use parentese that we all seem to do without even that's thinking right. about it. But there are lots of debates about whether that's even the best way to do that. I think the evidence is really firm that the, uh, in favour of the fact that you should talk to your baby as much as you can using parentese. I can see you. I can see you. <laughs> I know that Elsie responds better to me when I speak to her in a baby speak, but to see that the science is proven that is amazing. I've often wondered why we all talk to babies like that. She's going to stare at all the men with their toys. With their big toys. Look at those big toys. The fact that brainwaves actually sync up with it is really, really incredible. Ow! Ow! No. This, we are entering witching hour, by the way. 